Yeah, Mackenzie, thanks so much. I spent most of the morning and early afternoon in the southwest Georgia area right now in Valdosta, Georgia, where, as you can see, it's pretty clear out here. It doesn't even look like a hurricane is heading our way. But, of course, officials and people that live in this area say they don't expect Hurricane Helene to make landfall again until later on this evening. Now, we also spent most of the morning and early afternoon in Tifton, Georgia, where people have already started evacuating. That's that's a little under an hour away from where we are right now, specifically from Florida coming to Georgia, hoping that the hurricane and its impact won't be as bad in this area. They've been at gas stations, getting that gas, filling their tanks and preparing themselves for the hurricane ahead. One woman from Florida says her family lives there, so they're used to getting having to get up, pack up and evacuate when necessary. We have three small children and I do not want to be stuck somewhere where I can't get out. So we were just like, okay, I guess it's time to go. And as I've said, we sp will spend the evening here in Valdosta keeping track of this hurricane and its impact once it makes landfall this evening. For now, I'm live in Valdosta, Jasmine Butler, WTOC News. Well, with Helene